Hello people of YouTube, my name is Chris Mon, and welcome back to another video. In this video, we're playing Pokemon Fire Red, and we're continuing our Let's Play. Alright, so in the last episode, we went through Rock Tunnel, that hellish of a place. I'm never going back there. And let's get out of Valander Town, or Valander, Lavender Town, because that music was kind of creeping me out. Yeah, so Lavender Town, we're actually, we're not actually supposed to do anything in there until after we beat Solon City. According to the official uh, Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play, or Walkthrough Guide. So yeah, uh, can we, uh, look at we're gonna have to reverse one of these trainers. Oh well, it's good training at least, because, uh, we're reversing, uh, the, uh, s shoot, I forget, Celadon City Gym Leader, Erica, I think? I will double check with you after I am confirmed, but it's up to the E, I'm pretty sure of that. I don't know why I forget it, I, I should've looked, <laughs> I should've remembered, but I don't know. Anyways, uh, yeah, so in the last episode... Wait, I already did my recap. Alright, so, uh, I just gotta train up my Pokemon a lot, cause, uh... Oh, if you the one Pokemon I didn't want out. Okay, I gotta train my Pokemon a lot, cause they are fairly underleveled. Not a lot, but just a little bit, you know? Like, minorly. Cause, uh, the max level, or the, uh, Pokemon... The Ace Pokemon's highest level is, uh, 29 at, uh, Celadon Gym. So, we gotta get our Pokemon at least level 30, or around 29. Somewhere around there, because this gym is a grass type gym, so basically we have every advantage to it. We have Charmeleon, Pidgeotto, uh, Butterfree even has a. Uh, Butterfree is even good against it, but I don't think we're going to use it for this gym. I'm not quite sure. I mean, we do have Needle King also, which is good, because uh, Poison beats Grass. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. For your, the more you know. But, anyways, yeah. But I'm gonna have to say, sadly, we are gonna be departing with- We are gonna be departing one of our members today. I know, it, it- it breaks my heart to say, but we're gonna have to replace one of our members. It's just that time, man, dude. There's like, we're at the point of the game where there's better Pokemon, there's better things to get, there's better things to do, and I'm just afraid that we have to, uh, replace one. But, I'm- I think you guys know which one I'm gonna replace, or which one I'm- which two I'm debating I'm replacing. I'll get further into that whenever, like, we're actually there, but for right now, we just have to take care of freaking, uh, beating this Vulpix. I swear to God. Yep, of course. What else would I expect? I just want to get through this, okay? I don't want to verse any trainers. I'll do that off camera or something like that. Uh, I can go around these two, right? Yes. Thank God. Oh, my God. I'm being extra careful to not run into any of these. Please be it. Yes, thank God. Okay. We've made it, finally. Wait, what? What? Oh my god, another underground. Oh my god, and we're gonna have to versus trainer, aren't we? Yep. Alright, well, two trainers isn't that bad. Alright, so Super Nerd Aiden, I'm just gonna quickly do this battle, then I'll get back to you guys whenever, uh, who knows, whenever we're out of this, or whenever I'm done, like, you know, training up my Pokemon. Alright, so the underground path, our Charmeleon got poisoned, so... Maybe we can hopefully uh, get to the Pokemon Center before he dies. I mean, there's no trainer, so I don't really have to uh, pay close attention to how he's doing. Because even if he faints or not, we're still going to the Pokemon Center no matter what. So let's quickly get back here. Route 7. Um, I don't see why we had to do that. I mean, there's why does the police officer not allow us to go through? But anyways, we're here. We see a Team Rocket grunt. Just passively just wave, say goodbye. And and infamous faints. Wow, if this was a Nuzlocke, I'd be super pissed, but thankfully it's not. I mean, if it wasn't Nuzlocke, I'd probably heal it by now. So yeah. Anyways, we heal our Pokemon, and I want to do uh, two things before I enter the gym. One, I am gonna get a new party member. Uh, not quite sure if I want to uh, replace one of my party members this episode or next episode. Still a little bit torn. Uh, is this the way to get to the place where I want to go? Yes, this is the place. Okay. Oh okay, god, these staircases kill me. Anyways, we just gotta go up here, and I think you guys know who I'm getting. If you couldn't tell by now, uh, I mean, that, that guy's not the owner, but we just get this Pokemon for free. You guys may have heard of it. Its name is called Eevee. Anyways, we obtained Eevee. Yes, and do you want to give it a nickname? Yes, I am going to give it a nickname, like all my other Pokemon. And, uh, what I'm planning to evolve this Eevee is into Jolteon, and... Considering that it is an electric type, that means we are going to be replacing Pikachu. Yeah, I'm sorry, just the time has to come, but I don't know if I want to replace him yet. Still on the safe side right now, but we're going to name him Sparky, because 
One, I used to play a lot of, uh, shoot, what was it called? Uh, I used to play a lot of uh, Pokemon Go whenever it was still, you know, relevant, and th there was, like, this glitch in the game where you can, like, choose what Eevee you want by either naming it, like, either, uh, shoot, what were the names? Uh, Pyro, Sparky, and I forget Vaporeon's name. Uh, probably come back to me. I think it was, uh, hmm, Aqua? Nah. Uh, I don't know why it is. Not really that important, but S P A R K Y. Yeah, that is Spark. That's how you spell Sparky. And we officially added Sparky to the team. Placed in the box, so it's actually technically not on the team quite yet, but it will probably after uh, we defeat this gym. Because I do want to, uh, I do want to uh, have one last goodbye battle for uh, my existing team already. Surprised that we already have six members on our team. Felt like just yesterday that uh, we caught these Pokemon. Uh, why are all of these, like, gyms, uh, blocked by these trees? Don't understand. How do all these other trainers get by? Don't know, and there is a man peeping there. Uh, if, if you guys don't, uh, trust me, here, gym is great. Yep, see, exactly. I don't think that's PG. Um, before I do so, uh, I'm gonna do one battle with Charmeleon, then I'm gonna start leveling up my other Pokemon before I actually verse the leader, because, uh, my Pokemon are still fairly underleveled. Everyone except Charmeleon, of course, because he's my ace. But yeah, uh, they are all level 23, but the main fight is like level 29, level 30-ish. So we just gotta pay attention to that. I think that after this battle, Infernus will probably uh, rank up. Yeah, probably, most likely, depending on how many Pokemon this person has. Maybe not, actually. Yeah, probably not. We're gonna have to probably do one more battle. Who knew that choosing Charmander would actually help you one day? I know like Charmander is probably the least like uh, least uh, useful in the Kanto game, considering that the first gym is Rock and then the second gym is Water. So Bulbasaur would obviously be like the best choice, but I I am a Charizard fan, Charmander, whatever. I'm I'm a huge fan of that line, so that's why I chose Charmander. Team uh, Team Charmander for life, I guess. My opinion is not changing, so yeah, that. That statement's never going away. Why did I press that? I don't know. Um, so after this battle, yeah, we're gonna trade out Infernus because he'll be level 30, and level 30 is fine for me. So he reaches level 30, and I think the next Pokemon we're gonna try is, uh, actually, let me check. Uh, Twitter? Yeah, let's get Twitter to, like, level 26 or 27. I don't want them to be too low. And if they are too low, I'm sorry then. I do also want to bring out my Butterfree and Pikachu, because these are going to be their last goodbyes. Well, one of their goodbyes. It's going to be one of the two, because Magikarp, you still have to evolve into Gyarados, and after it evolves into Gyarados, it becomes a beast. Like, it's unstoppable. And it's probably the best water type, besides Squirtle and Blastoise, that you can get in the game. So, with this last gust, we probably kill the Oddish. It survives? What? I did not expect that, and we get paralyzed. Of course, look okay, like they're gonna have to go to the Pokemon Center after this. Please kill it. It's, it's dead, thank god. Uh, Twitter gets to level 26. And we finally get to be over with this uh, freaking battle. Oh, there's one more, of course. Let's actually bring out uh, Monarch for this last battle. It's only level 21, not that high, but... I don't think I'm really gonna be using it for this battle, because we do have Charmeleon after all. Let's do Confusion. And that is a one-hit KO. Wow. That should do a lot of XP. 378? Not that bad. Level 22? We'll take it. So, uh, I think we just have to verse this last trainer right here. Which I will do. Then I will go heal my Pokemon. And then, uh, that... Then I have to verse a gym leader, and that will be it for the episode. Wow. That fast. Hmm. Who knew? So, let's send out, uh... Let's send out Twitter, okay? Because Twitter's gonna be our second ace. Because flying beats grass, of course, obviously. And this is actually one of the few gyms that my party excels at. Because Brock, we had a terrible team. Or, not a good team. Because all my Pokemon were weak against Rock. And especially ground types. But, well, actually not especially because we have two flying types. But Pikachu and Charmeleon are super weak against them. So, us like actually beating him on our first try was pretty nice. And then we had to verse Misty. We had Pikachu for that. So it wasn't really that hard. 
Then Lieutenant Surge, super easy. Thought it was gonna be really hard. Feel like the only trouble we had was freaking rock tunnel. Can't believe I lost that freaking hiker. I might as well just skip through this entire battle because you know we're obviously gonna win this no matter what. I mean they're like this is just easy grinding. So let's just hope for the best. Like I mean what? Wow, okay, they can use potions, did not know that. I thought only the uh, gym leaders could. Well, you learn something new every day, so that's nice. Vine Whip, ooh, that's gonna do a lot of damage, not. Uh, I'm just spamming Gust right now, like, I'm just like tapping the button as fast as I can. Gloom, uh, no, eh, I'll do one more battle with uh, Pidgeotto and then I'm gonna send out Pikachu. I guess because, uh, I don't know why. Just want him to have his last farewell goodbye battle, something. Still on the save on which one I'm gonna get rid of. I'll decide that next episode. But yeah, I uh, gloom absorbs and yeah. So also, uh, why I'm actually deciding between those two is because I'm not gonna evolve my Eevee to Jolteon right away. I'm gonna wait a little bit because uh, if we do get rid of Butterfree, we do still have an Electric type and a Normal type. And uh, I am planning on capturing another normal type later in game. I have this entire like let's play figured out in like a document or something, so it's all good. Um, so if we do get Eevee, I'm not. If we do replace Butterfree, I'm not gonna evolve Eevee right away. But if I do replace Pikachu, then I will. The problem is Pikachu is probably better than Butterfree, and we do get to learn Wing Attack. That's nice. I will only say an attack. I'm not one of those foul players. So yeah, that would be nice. So. It's up to you guys, uh, what do you guys think I should do? Put it down in the comments. I'm actually gonna exit the gym and heal my Pokemon, and I'll be back whenever I actually heal my Pokemon. Alright, and we're back. I healed my Pokemon, as you can see here. I am planning on, uh, yeah, I'll keep Twitter. I was gonna plan on Infinis, but, you know, Twitter's a good choice. I'll send him out for the first, uh, first opponent, first Pokemon, and then I'll, you know, replace him with, uh, Tremeleon. That'll be all good. So, yes, final battle, or fourth gym leader. I was thinking final battle for my team. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh, dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. See, I was close, okay? It's Erica. I am the leader of Celadon's gym. I am a student of the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are solely of the grass type. and eh, not a really good type to uh, be using. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. Well, you are a gym leader, so. Very well, but I shall not lose. You're gonna lose, okay? No, I'm, I'm just calling it, like, it's 99.8% that you're gonna lose. Probably one of the easiest gym leaders to verse. And, if, why, why would you lead if you're ace? Don't understand. Okay, I was planning on doing this with, uh, Infinis. I guess I could still do that. Yeah, I'll probably still do that, because he just stun supported me. So, uh, let me go trade into, uh, Infernus. Please come. Please go faster. Acid. Okay. I think we could take this. Ooh, not as well as I thought. Well, Ember should take care of it. Right? Ah, so close. Please make it burn. Ah, uh, nah. At least he missed the uh, stun spore. That's nice. And, of course, there's a hyper potion. Wait, you can get hyper potions now? Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. There's like this uh, gigantic mall complex that we can go to. Oh, I have to go check that out. And, yes, we get a critical hit. Super effective, one shot Victra Bell. Actually, kind of a surprise for that. Uh, Tangela. Yeah, why not? I'll uh, take out. I think Tangela's the weakest one. So I'll take out Twitter for it. Yeah. And, uh, Tangela. Level 24 only. Wow. That would be, uh, a little bit higher, like level maybe 26 or, uh, 25. Nah, 24, I think. Then the next Pokemon has to be like level 27 around. Just like estimating because of the level range. And could you stop healing yourself? Thank you. I don't want any more... Mm, could you stop with the Giga Dreams? My sir. Or my ma'am because you are female. Please, just guess the crap out of it. Why is it taking... Why is it not doing as much damage as I thought? Ah, uh, this is gonna take forever. Constrict. Oh, now we can't escape. But oh well, he's probably gonna die right here, right now. Yep, thank god, critical hit. Alright, after that, you're probably gonna rank up to level 28. Yep, that's what I thought. Alright, 
So what's the next Pokemon? The Vile Plume. Okay, uh... Let's send out Infernus again, because I wanted to get this over with very fast. Alright, so, uh... Come out, Vile Plume. Oh, it's also level 29. Huh. That would be level 27 for some reason. Hmm. Well, I guess I'm happy that I changed it to Infernus then. Because we probably would have died if, uh... If, uh, if I chose a different Pokemon. But, Paralysis, please don't do any harm to me. Inference, please survive it. And don't get po- Actually, you can't get poisoned, but you do. Skip a turn. That sucks. Um, this won't kill us, hopefully. No critical hit, thank god. And Ember, please. Yes! And with that, we defeat Erica. I told you, 99.8 chance of, of us winning. So, yeah. Get 1000 XP, wow. No, I should have probably like put Magikarp and switched out, but uh, oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer on you the Rainbow Badge. I don't know why it's called the Rainbow Badge. I don't know. The Rainbow Badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. Wow, it also allows Pokemon to use Strength in and out of battle. Don't have Strength yet, but yeah. Please also take this with you. Uh, TM19. What is that? Giga Drain. Oh, that's really useful. I don't think I have any Pokemon that can learn it, but I will take it. Half the damage it inflicts, it heals you, um, yeah, I agree. Alright, so that was, uh, very eventful. Uh, so yeah, with that, I'm gonna call that an episode. Sorry if this is a little bit short, just that, that's all I really need to do this episode. Next episode, uh, will be a little bit longer because of the tasks that we have to do. But yeah, after I cut this tree, I will do my outro. So, if you liked this video, consider subscribing, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye!